I stand happily corrected. YouTube user the one and only PZ has let me know that they have actually fixed the calendar and email Google integration in Windows 10. If you're unaware, in Windows 8 and 8.1 around mid to late 2013-ish, I want to say, they completely cut off the ability to use Google Calendar and I believe Gmail with the built-in Windows 8 calendar and email applications. And this was extremely frustrating and when I kind of switched from my Surface to my Chromebook. But apparently they have fixed that, so we're going to pull up the calendar application it is a trusted Windows Store app for Windows 10, and it says, Welcome! The, this clean and modern calendar is perfect for life's events. Let's get started. We're not going to add Outlook. Oh, we already have Outlook. We're going to add, because I already have a Google account, or Microsoft account. But we're going to add a Google account. As you can see, there's a Google option here. Alright, it's going to let us do it. So I'm going to... Sign into my Google account, and I did just confirm that it does in fact work with two-step verification, so that is good to know. I do have two-step verification on my account, and it allowed me to still use it. Now we're ready to go. Do I want to add any other accounts? Do I have... No, I, I really don't. So, click ready to go. And boom! Look at that. My Google Calendar embedded here within Windows 10 like a boss. So it does in fact work and all you got to do is choose that custom Google account option. So we're also going to go ahead while we're doing this, set up the email app and set up our lock screen. So we're going to minimize Chrome here. We're going to go to settings. We're going to go to personalization. I'm going to turn on my, for my, doo -doo -doo -doo. there we go. For my lock screen apps, I'm going to have my calendar as the detailed app and then the weather app as one down here. Actually, it's going to be that one. And then we're going to have mail as an app as well. Since apparently, mail is going to work. I'm not going to use the mail app very often. However, having it there will still be useful. Now, whenever I log out, I should have that option available to me. So we're also going to go to start again, and we're going to click the mailbox. We're going to click maximize it here and click get started. We already have our accounts added because we already added them to the calendar. So I'm going to click ready to go. And boom. My email's here. You don't need to read it. That's fine. But it's here. I have all of my email here. So in theory, if I wanted to use the Windows Mail app, it is available to me. So thank you very much to the one and only PZ. You can set up Google Calendar and Mail with the Windows 10 stuff, which is pretty freaking awesome. I do hope this video was helpful to you if it was, because it was helpful to me. Leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more awesome videos. I do have a playlist link in the description below to a lot more Windows 10 related videos that I've been putting up over the past couple days. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. My name has been Adam Mariposvox. Bye bye. Woo!